Hey everyone, this is part 3 on how to make the camera rotate and zoom towards your character. So what we were doing now is we were in the middle of making the camera zoom in and out towards the character. And I just added a sensor controller actuator. Now we need to change the sensor to mouse, wheel up, and change this to property add property camera value 1. Now this works the same way as the empty since this property acts as an IPO now when we scroll the mouse wheel up it's gonna add a value of 1 so it's basically gonna do this each time it adds a value of 1 the camera will move in. Uh, let's make it so we could zoom out add a sensor controller actuator and change this to mouse wheel up or sorry this one has to be wheel down and change this to property add property camera value negative one now if we go to game or right here select show uh, print the debug info and right here go to game and select show debug properties basically what this does is it prints out this property onto the screen when you play the game so you can see what's going on if I go into camera view and hit P to play if I scroll the mouse wheel you can see that it zooms in and right here where it says 12 that's the frame number but if I keep scrolling it up you can see that it goes above 20 which is the number of frames that we put if I scroll out it goes below 1 and we want it to stay in between 1 and 20 and to do that we'll just use expressions which are pretty simple to use and really uh, they're really useful so right here on the first one change the and to expression. Now we need to change the name of the sensor. So this one we're going to call it zoom in. Now I already did a tutorial on this, but I decided to just remake it along with this and I'm going to delete the other video. Anyways, rename this zoom in and in the expression type in camera, which is this property camera less than 20 and zoom in which is this, the name of this uh, the sensor equals true so only when the property camera is less than 20 will it zoom in this one we need to do something similar so change it to expression and we also need to rename it so name it zoom out on the expression type in camera greater than one so when this property camera is greater than one and zoom out equals true so only when this property is less is greater than one will it zoom out so if it's above one, it'll zoom out. Once it reaches one, it will stop zooming out. So if we hit zero and P to play, you can see that we could zoom in. And it doesn't go above 20, and it doesn't go below one. And we could also rotate around the view and zoom in and out as we want. And once we go to, to the center right here, it resets the rotation. So that's it for this tutorial. I hope it helps. Uh, just one quick little tip. Uh, sometimes it's really annoying to rotate and grab and move the camera into the position you want. So a really easy way to do this is to hit Control Alt and Zero on the numpad. So if I hit Control Alt Zero on numpad, you can see that it positions my camera in the view that I'm currently in. So it's really useful it's a really useful feature instead of just rotating and grabbing your camera it goes a lot faster 
So I hope this tutorial helps. If you have any requests, just send me a message or post a comment.